Welcome to short tutorials. Today I'm going to show you a few things you can do in Doodly. So let's go to Doodly and create new video. Here you can choose the background of your video. I'm going to choose white background and put a title Doodly tutorial. Press create. And um, in the video creation, I go to settings on the left side where you can set um, for every slide to be the same so you can choose the hand either real hand or cartoon hand 2d or 3d hand sometimes I use it for creation for creating um, video for children you can choose left-handed or right-handed hand uh, let's go back to real hand and choose the hand that we will use for this video you can also see how it would look with different background and you can also change it here it's a black border you can go to custom where you can decide for different color of your background you can play with this colorful palette of colors or you can go below and just click on the color you like the most so I'm going with a um, white background at the moment you can choose the exit of the scenes, how they would transition to the next scene, either to right, left, up, bottom, or one go right, one go left. On the top, we have the title of our video. Uh, here you can turn off Doodly Rainbow. Um, I will show you later on in this video how that works. And Let's decide for this video to give different color of the background. So we press custom and let's choose the color for our scenes. I like this color, so let's press apply. But before we do that, let's choose the hand, this hand, this hand for our videos. Now we are ready, we can press apply. So the settings we set means every scene will have pink background and the hand we chose and the exiting mode for every scene. You can you see when I press plus, other scene comes with the same background color. Let's just um, write welcome. You choose a font you want to use. And let's type something, let's type welcome. Now we can play with the size and position it where we like it. Somewhere in the center. If we decide to give letters different color, again we can choose from the colors and change it to desirable color. On the right side, we can play with delay and duration of this sign. So let's say we would like it to have some delay. So it comes maybe one second after the scene opens. And duration of writing, um, let's give it a three seconds. It would, it would look like this. And we would like to put some extra seconds at the end of the scene so viewers can absorb the scene and not rush to the next scene. Now we are at the second scene and we can write doodly since this video is about doodly. And I'm going to show you how easily you can change font. Just drag another font and see how it would look. And press yes, replace. You do not have to erase and write, type it again. Now 
Okay, so we have the title for this scene and let's bring somebody working on laptop. Let's take this guy and bring him to our scene. Okay, let's make him a little bit bigger and here at the moment there's no delay we will put a delay for the sign one second it's a short wor word so one two seconds should be enough and delay for the picture let's have a look how it would look at the moment we preview this scene so we have doodly and right after the hand starts drawing man working on laptop So uh, let's click on the picture of the man working on laptop and you can see how that would look on the scene. We would like the color to fade in. It looks much better. Save and return. And let's give the picture one second delay and duration of the fading in and drawing would be three seconds. And let's preview the scene again. and voila. Let's give it a few seconds at the end and press apply. We can change the exit of the scene to left side. Okay, let's go to the next scene and let's say for this scene we would like to have a white background so we have this we have to turn this off and change the color of the background to white. And we do not want to have any hand for this scene, so we press no hand. Apply. Now the background is white. And let's bring another, uh, let's bring this lady to the scene. She's working on laptop. Preview of the scene would look like this. Again, we do not like this color coming from but from the top to the bottom we would like it to fade it in so we change it to fade save and return and give it some delay after have a second delay and some delay at the end of the scene so let's preview okay let's add another scene and when we press plus the settings that we set at the beginning will apply so it will be pink background and I just want to show you how we can change this picture to be without color so you can see how it looks at the moment but let's see if we can make this picture without color so we go to settings and we just turn off doodly rainbow just for this scene, the rainbow is off and we give some extra time. Now the colors are off. So let's go uh, create another scene. We press plus button and of course it's pink. So let's go and change the color to bluish color and press apply. This, we'll give it extra time and press apply. This scene will be blue violet blue and let's say the next scene we would like to have exactly the same color so how we can bring exactly the same color um, so let's go back to that scene with the blue color and this is the number of the color and you have it also here we copy it and go to the scene the next scene that we want it to be blue and we paste the number in this space and press apply. The color will be exactly the same. So when you have scenes that you want the same color, maybe three, four, five scenes in your video, you just copy the color and paste it where you want it. When you press plus, the next video, the next scene would be pink since the settings for the video is that every scene will be pink. 
but you can change the color of everything as you desire. So this was short tutorial for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please consider subscribing and have a wonderful, wonderful day. See you next time. Bye.